Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we have another very, very exciting video. Today we are going to Whipsnade Sea. Oh my gosh, so excited. Second big day out. If you saw my Woodside vlog, then this one's going to be similar, but for Woodside. I'm not um, fully dressed yet, so I'm not going to show you what I'm wearing. But I think I've got Oliver sorted. So, first of all, excuse the state of his bed. He doesn't actually sleep in his bed. He sleeps with me. But we're having a good sort out at the minute. So, everything's just ended up here. So, you know, we'll just ignore that at the minute. But I'm thinking of having a vest. Because Whipsnade is very open. And it can get very cold. I see that really hot or really cold because there's not much shade or shelter should I say so it's probably going to be really cold today so it's got this vest he's got this which is from Sainsbury's which I thought is perfect zoo themed and I couldn't find any jogging bottoms to go with it so I've got these jeans but these are drawstring so they should be as comfy as jogging bottoms in some way because they're not got any buttons and they shouldn't be tight there's a lot of room in there so yeah I thought this is what he'll be wearing today plus his coat we will have and these are from George at Asda this is from George at Asda just like most things and we've got some nappies because I need to fill up his nappy All bag. All I need to do now is go and make our lunch get us something to eat because it is an all day thing there is a lot of spaces to sit down and eat which is quite nice sit in front of one of the animal enclosures and yeah so we're gonna make ourselves a nice picnic and I'll catch up with you in a bit stage oh my gosh it was just yesterday when I was saying about going to Woodside literally the next day but I got so excited I just literally <laughs> booked everything but we're half an hour early but that's fine we've got a really good parking space we're right near the front so oh my goodness another very exciting day cannot wait to see my favorite's the giraffes oliver i'm not quite sure he just likes this this big hill he just likes running up and down that and last time we was literally spent the whole time up and down this hill so hopefully we won't be doing that again but oh my goodness We've got zoo passes, annual passes for Whipsnade and London. So it's just so exciting finally being able to do this again. And oh, the relief. I'm sure everyone is feeling the same. But yeah, let's get out and get going. So we came in just over there, cafe's open, I don't know where we're going to go yet, Oliver's in his buggy, I decided to bring it today. Where are you going Oliver? Yes. Are you having fun? Is that fun? Yeah. yeah. Where should we go? Wow, well, the day has really brightened up. It's so nice. I bought this really big long duvet coat, expecting it to be absolutely freezing. But it's actually really nice. So hopefully we're in luck today. As you can see, there's a bison behind us. Oliver's running around just past the chimps. I can just feel it's going to be the best day. One thing I love as well about Whipsnade is the enclosures are so big. They have got so much space. It's just so lovely. I normally get quite upset when I go to like farms and zoos and things because I think they just don't have much space. But I like this one. I went to some places in Florida 
and oh my goodness, it was so tiny and small and it was just awful. It really upset me. I put a nice big complaint in about that. But <laughs> so if you can hear the noise of the buggy, it's very hard ground. But oh, this is something so relaxing about being here. I know I keep saying it and you're going to be sick of me saying it by the end of it, but I'm just so happy to be out. What have you found, Oliver? 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 What have you found? A tree? You found a tree? Wow, isn't this a beautiful tree? I'm literally just losing him now. He's just seen open space and he's running. Don't know what animals we're gonna get to see. But like I said, I've got the path, so it's not costing me anything, he's free, so it's all about him and giving Oliver the best day. What have you found, Oliver? Have you found a nice big stick? We are currently by the African hunter dogs. I don't know if you can see them. Right around back there. You just about see them through the trees. There they go, there they are. Okay, so this stick is now in the buggy, so I assume we are taking this stick with us. So this is, this is gonna be fun. Oh, this is run off. Sorry if this is quite shaky. I keep taking it off my tripod because people keep ringing me, but <laughs> one of them days I feel very loved and popular. Oh, off he goes. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh dear, have you fallen down? Oh good boy. Oh, there's a little chair there so you can sit and watch. Love these out of the way places. And we found the giraffes. I'm so excited. You can go inside and actually see them. We've got pie and see them. It's so lovely. There's more of the African hunting dog enclosure. I just love how much they do it up. It's so lovely. And it's just all just trees and you actually feel like you're in the middle of nowhere instead of yeah, you know, in the middle of a zoo. Oh dear. So we've had another incident. Oliver has fallen over and grazed both of his knees. So we've got some more plasters on. <laughs> I think I'm going to be buying them very soon. Oliver, what are you doing? No, going up the stairs, darling. No, that's blocked off for a reason. Oliver, come out, please. So normally you park your buggy here and you can go up this ramp and up here and into here to see the giraffes. It's all blocked off, I'm assuming because of COVID. But look how beautiful they are. They're definitely my favourite animals to watch. Absolutely love them. We're going to walk around and see if we can get a better view after Oliver's tantrum stops because he is in a mood because I wouldn't let him climb the stairs. And for anyone who's thinking of going to the zoo, there's the rules. Oh, Oliver. Oh, look at that face. So half-hearted. <laughs> Aren't they gorgeous? Oh, 
Oliver, come here, darling. Oh, I could literally watch them all day. I've missed these little guys. I don't remember what they are. But they are so cute and they just run wild. All the way around the zoo. They are just so cute. We're still by the giraffes. Over there somewhere. Oliver. Oliver is just having constant meltdowns. I think going to the farm yesterday and the zoo today is just too much for him. But that's taught me a lesson not to do two big days at once. But, you know, you live and you learn, don't you? Every child's different and everyone's stamina is different. So that's just taught me not to do two big days in one go. I mean, I booked Florida for January, so doing big days for two weeks is gonna be fun. Oh look, there's these little guys again, hold on. Aren't they just so cute? And they're so tame as well. They're not bothered at all about me walking past them. Just love to know what they are. Every time I come, I find out and then I always forget. But that is just typical me. And you've got some rhinos over there. This is what's currently going on. If anyone's planning on going. The play area is closed, the railway is closed. So, yeah, not much going on, but you know, you can kind of forgive them with everything going on. I'm just glad it's open. I don't think we've got, oh, there's zebras over there. Oh no, I can't zoom in this way. But yeah, even if we're not here too long, because like I said, Oliver is so upset and grumpy, but if we're not here that long, then it's fine. There's the zebra. And again, Oliver is just... You're not a happy boy today, are you? <laughs> in front of me, he keeps staring at me. Every time I start vlogging, it's put me off a bit. So if I'm a bit choppy in what I'm saying, and that's why <laughs> I've never really vlogged out in public before, so I'm a bit like, Arr. but you know, it's fine, it's fun. And I just need to get used to people watching and thinking things, but you know, it's all good. If you look right at the back, I think that's Anton. Yo. I mean, you can't even see the end of this enclosure, it's so huge. Yeah, it's like the annoying area, but yeah, I'm guessing it goes all the way around back there. And, oh, it's just so lovely. Sure, what's in there? But I might go and investigate. So, you found something Oliver wanted today, and that is have his lunch. It's about what time is it? It's 10 44. But you know, maybe he's having a ghost spell or something. I never like to say no to him when he's hungry, just in case he is. You know, having a ghost bit or something, but we are still by the rhinos. So we have a nice view. You want these open? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah,
And he's up again. Did you like the lions, Oliver? He kept going. We've got cats, and so I think that's a big cat. <laughs> I hope ours don't get that big. Don't really know where we're going. My mum's more more than that, but she's not with us. So, just following right, see where we end up. I don't know how many times I've been here, I always get lost. The lines are in there. That's where we just was. You can see one. Just there. Oh, just sort of behind the tree. But I'm not sure what's over there. We've now stopped for another bite to eat and a little drink after seeing the lines which are over there. We thought we'd take this seat for the zebra. We can watch them as we have our next snack and a drink, which I thought is a very nice idea. One thing I love about Whipside is the view. Isn't that stunning? And there's benches you can go and sit down there and have your lunch while just looking out at the view. Isn't that just lovely? Oliver! Again, get up on that. If anyone's interested. Is this Oliver? I think if it rains, you've got somewhere to go. Well, we can look out on whatever is in here because I have no idea. <laughs> Where are you going, Oliver? Oliver, darling, careful of the road. was in that thing in this enclosure. <laughs> it's got to be more than just this guy. Don't have this guy. Oh duck. But another enclosure over there. I'm not sure if it's in there. There's some hippos over there. There's my finger. Over there, some hippos. So, can we go see them next? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna hunt for coffee. So hopefully, I'm gonna find a coffee. Oh look! Can you see the duck, Oliver? Can you see the duck? He's a gorgeous boy, isn't he? Oh, duck! Oh, there's two of them. There's another one there. Well, they might be laying a nest. That could be why they're a bit wary of us. They could be laying a nest. So let's go leave them alone. I don't want to disturb them. They do look a bit scared. I don't see this one. So let's go leave them alone and let's go and see their hippos. See what they can find somewhere else in their enclosure. Can we see the tiger? Oh, we should have taken photos. Can you write down there? Are you in? Well, he did. He's got welly boots on. So he's got his welly boots on. He's got an ice cream. So I needed a coffee. No, he's just chilled. <laughs> he's definitely. Do you think he's on the moon? No, it's a brown I love you. 
whole time we was here. That one is it. <laughs> so we went around the complete opposite way. We haven't been to every animal, but he is just so tired. He's barely gonna which is not like Oliver at all. He's normally out running, playing, but I think yesterday being the first big day out really has taken out of him. I mean, I know it's taken out of me as well, but yeah, for a while until he gets used to being out again, I can't um, take more big days out together. But you know, like I said, you live and you learn. And the Halabazoo, the park is still closed. Which is a shame because he keeps asking to go on the swings, but never mind. You know, these things happen and the sea lions are gone now. And I heard one of the workers say that they're going to be turned into aviaries. Apparently they've got a lot of birds that um, are hidden that we aren't seen by the public. So that's what they're going to do there is put all the aviaries there so we can see more birds, which will be nice. So sad about the sea lions they're one of my favorites the ones I always look forward to seeing but never mind you know these things have to change but we're near the entrance now so I don't really know what we're going to do I might see if the petting zoo is open see if we can see the goats maybe I don't know if it will be or not but it's worth a try heading over there looks like the petting zoo is open so let's go see some goats let's be pigs Goats over there, so let's go find them. Oliver, we found the goats. They're not allowed in like normal, but I'm assuming that's due to COVID. But normally you can walk in and pet them, but yeah, I think because of um, obviously touching them and catching something, they're not allowed. But that's fine. One day it'll all be open again. But Oliver, goats. Are you excited? Yeah. Goat, I know. Do you want to come out and see them? Yeah. Come on in. That's right, can you see them? Oh, goats. Aren't they lovely? Hey, you did again. Oliver, the goat's funny. Hey! Hey! <laughs> Are they funny? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> Come on! This is the most interested he's been to see them. All day yesterday. Yeah. And it's the most interesting it's been in any animal. <laughs> Oliver, are you having fun up there? Yeah. Are you having fun? Literally living his best life right now. <laughs> and that is us done. It's it is one twenty seven. And Oliver was just tired, getting grumpy, so I had to fall asleep. So I said, do you want to go home? And he goes, yeah. So we're going home now. But I booked Whipsnade again for the end of the month at some point. So, you know, we'll still go again and have some time out. But I think two big days when we've been out so long, um, when we've been in lockdown so long, it's just really um, done us both in. So we'll go home now. We've had a bit of fresh air. Mm. And I'm sure Oliver will sleep. I just need to figure out how to get out of here because I don't have a clue. I'm parked in a bit I don't normally park out because I was so early. But yeah, I'm sure I'll figure it out. But I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you are really enjoying my content at the minute with us getting out and doing a bit more. If you are, please give it a thumbs up. Please hit that subscribe button. And we will see you in our next video. Bye.